on the on the uh, flip side there before before my time runs out obviously this mm-hmm. is a film that needs as much oxygen as it possibly can you know people want to you know talk about it it's come out of sundance it's independent it's an important story and you you know you, you do all these interviews everything to give it give it as much kind of oxygen as to say that you could possibly possibly give it then on your second film you've gone on to a film that you can't talk about <laughs> because it's such a it's such a, a you you know you say the words batman and straight away yeah right. i'm in i'm in the batman film oh who do you play oh, no, no, i don't know i don't know but how was that experience going from that to because i know obviously you, you can't say a thing but we've seen a trailer we kind of get the gist of what we're hopefully going to see which is very different to the others but f- for you personally how was the experience going from something like that to then something as big and as secretive as as a superhero film like that i mean it's a total uh 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 shock to the system right like it's really it i think because of just how the timing of everything i'm coming out of a training program in which i've only ever done theater and then i've got to go into this indie film and do this and golden dialect and do Kuduro dancing neither of which i'm skilled in at all that's a whole lot of fun and then going from that and having to go to this big major film in which the first day we've got three or four cameras rolling at the same time and i'm not trying to look like i don't know what i'm doing so i don't ask any questions <laughs> and you know what i mean it's just it was a it was a lot but i didn't let myself think about that right it was more so i just got to do my work i got to show up and not get fired that was the thing I'm just gonna show up and not get fired because they could fire me right now and find somebody else. And you know what I mean? Uh, I didn't I didn't allow myself to think any bigger than that. Um, but then the beautiful surprise has been showing up to set with such an amazing crew and cast. Um, I've talked about this a little bit before of you know, Farewell and More was obviously a very intimate film and the way in which we filmed it was very intimate setting. Um, and I've been shocked by the, the way in which something as big as Batman, I can find those moments of intimacy with crew members. Uh, I mean, with COVID now it's a little difficult, right? But yeah, it's just, it's just amazing. Like I love showing up to my job. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a... It's not like we hear about people's first big films or first films, and it's just terrible stories that we hear. I ain't got that. I'm showing up to work, and I love it. I love it. <laughs> what did you What did you make of the? Obviously, we don't see you in the trailer, but what did you make of of that? Oh no, I'm it, in there. You just can't. Ah, oh, you see. You blink. You mi- you miss me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to go back and watch it now in like super high definition to find you. Right, exactly. But but that was extraordinary that they before I let you go. Extraordinary that they managed to put a trailer out knowing that the film was still filming and obviously has now been delayed yeah. because of, of of covid obviously as everything has been but mm-hmm. it, that that seems to be do you, from your experience is that is that how the film is or is that just a kind of a small drop in the pond as it were of what he's doing um I, well first of all i'll say when dylan and um the, our producer dylan and, and when matt texted me uh because they were about to release the trailer and they sent it and i saw it I text him, I said, that is sick. <laughs> that, yup, that is sick. I mean, cause especially because a lot of, a lot didn't get filmed. You know what I mean? Like we stopped maybe a month and a half into production. Um, so I was just amazed that they were able to get, you know, to get all of that. Um, uh, and it's just exciting. Like I'm a part of the project and I am still even more excited by that that trailer, that teaser that they dropped. Um, and I think people should continue to be excited. It's just, uh, the script is amazing and Matt is, is an amazing director and everybody in the cast is phenomenal. And it's just gonna be a really good film. Yeah, I think people with everything that's going on, I think people could wait. I'm looking forward. We'll happily wait a bit longer after seeing that. Yeah. Trailer. So uh, yeah, it's all, it's all good. <laughs> yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey, 